What's up everybody, John from Old Running Farm here. Thanks for joining us. In today's video, we are gonna have our alpacas review three different splash pads that we got from Amazon. They look very excited and ready to go. So we'll see. So this is the first one. So there was like a name on this and maybe I'll see if I can find it. But so this is the box, splash sprickler pad. Don't know what a sprinkler is, but <laughs> sounds good to me. So this one I liked, uh, this was the first one that I got as a replacement to our original one because this one's 87 inches wide. So it's very large. I think it was 30 bucks. Maybe I'll go through, uh, or maybe Catherine will go through when she, cause she always does, she does the editing now. So maybe Catherine will go through and tell us how much this splash pad cost and maybe what the actual name is. Maybe we'll even put a link to it in the description, even though there's no, no affiliate link or anything. So we have done several of, or, or we've done at least one video on the splash pads. And so it has been incredibly hot. And so our alpacas are overheated a little bit, as you can see by fake brownie right here, just basking in the sun. And so we do spray them off with the hose, just really just their, their legs and their neck, because that's where they, uh, I guess that's where they cool. Uh, but like, so if you spray them on their back or anything like that, then it, it instead of being evaporative cooling, it, it ends up overheating them. So the goal is to just, just like the undercarriage would really cool them off. As you can see, they're all here. So they know what's gonna happen. And we do have some Splash Pad All-Stars. Cookie right here is a big fan, as is Petal, who is the fawn one right here. Linda is also Macy. I mean. Most of our alpacas enjoy the splash pad, but I'm sure once this gets going, we'll also have Maggie over here. She is very pushy. Um, so this is going pretty well. So the, the way that these things work usually is that once you fill the whole ring up with water, there's little holes in it that start to spray up. And then once that happens, the, the pool fills in and all kinds of stuff. But so, my guess is that Cookie, Petal, and Linda are gonna be the first three in there. And then you'll see they'll sort of like get in there and then lay down and then they'll fight over it for a little bit. So this will be the first test to see who likes it the most. And this is Connie. That's her new baby boy right behind her. So you see now that they can see the little water jets they'll start to become interested in it. And then once once one of them goes in, they'll all start, they'll all start going in it. All right, so Connie is the first one in. <laughs> you know, never in my life did I think I would be calling play-by-play -play on alpacas and splash pads. Okay, so now... <laughs> They're definitely more interested in it. So Petal is right here, the fawn one right there. She'll probably lay down any minute now. Lori right here is also a big layer downer. So. All right, so now, <laughs> now we have Maple, Belinda, Petal, Cookie. Jojo was in there for a hot second. And I mean, you know, when you think about it, you know, imagine it being like 85 degrees outside and you have a fur coat on, you know, even though they, they have been shorn this year, so they've been shorn almost, almost two months now, um, but it's been super hot. Oh, called it. Pedal laying down. <laughs> uh, but it's, it's always so nice to see them enjoying something. And this one is actually, it's much bigger, I think by like almost two feet, almost two feet bigger. So then two feet bigger than the last one that we had, which is nice. Cause you know, obviously there's not enough room for everybody in there, but there's more room than the last one. All right, so Mags has now noticed that something's going on. So she's coming in to check it out. 
What do you guys think? See, there goes pedal laying down. And so like, it's not ideal that water gets on their back, but I don't think that's gonna be enough to really cause any problems. So Mags has joined the party. Mags is this old broad right there. And so this is also good. So Belinda is right here. Not, that's Cookie. This is Belinda with the ear hair, the black one with the ear hair. She's pregnant and she is due really any day now. So it's nice that she's able to get a little cool down. There goes Mags. <laughs> it's just so nice to see them like so clearly enjoying something. It's very nice. All right, so it's been a little while. I turned the hose off, but you can see they're still, <laughs> they're still enjoying it. But now, well, yeah. Our next one to try is gonna be this little splash tortoise sprinkler which I'm sure is a piece of garbage. <laughs> but uh, so this does a little spinny, sprinkly thing and we'll see how much they like this one. So I have the other one set up right over there. So I'm gonna go turn the water on. My prediction is they're gonna like this little puddle that's left over more than they like that, but we shall see. So this is interesting. So far, everybody's still over here. And it looks like maybe one of those doodads isn't quite working. It's certainly interesting though. Jojo is concerned. So far, no takers. Everybody's just more interested in standing in the puddle. Well, this is a very exciting part of the video. <laughs> We're literally every alpaca is just standing here. Some of them have their feet in the water. Some of them don't. What do you think, Mags? No? This sad little turtle. I wonder if the emus would like this. Belinda, you can check it out. Nobody's really interested. All right, so brought it down to the emus. It's funny. That? Yeah. Yeah. Like the, the one green wire is like not doing anything, but some of them are going crazy.
it is an interesting thing. So like, not that we're in the business of reviewing toys. Oh, now, now they're going a little crazy. I, but I could see how if you had a little kid, they would like this better than a farm. Oh yeah. But I mean, the whole reason why we have emus in the first place is because of that video of like the weasel tail on the ball that made the, the emu run around like crazy. And then Catherine was like, I want that. No, there's, a, there's like a straight up fetch video. Oh yeah, that's right. Dad seems semi-interested. Like oh, here we go. Getting close. No. I don't like it. What do you think, Bedhead? You talking to me? Alright, well, maybe we'll try it with the boy alpacas. Well, the boys make like it more than the girls. That's funny, this is, these new boys are here for that. All right, so it is funny. And maybe it's because we we already, the girls already had a sprinkle. But it might also be that like these boys are more familiar with like sprinklers. True. Because the girls are pretty much just used to splash pads. It's like a clever little design. You're in the background, just so you know. Oh, you just drank out of it. What? You just drank out of it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a little unpredictable. It is dead. Yeah, some of them have gotten stepped on and are like kinked. All right, Felix. This is cute. The butt. So this is number three. This is the bon, bonsai, bad eye, bonsai. Cyclone Splash Park. It's got chills with refreshing two ring splash pool and thrills with a banked curve slide and water sprinkling arch. Chills and thrills, baby. <laughs> All right, so uh, I'm gonna set this up and I think I'm actually gonna join the alpacas in this one. So let's get it going. Let's see what we got here. Oh boy. Oh, it's in pieces? Yeah. 
Oh, and we have a designated water watcher for safety first. Like the lifeguard, so. It's so. Is that the arch? It looks so small. Why is everything on Amazon so much smaller than it looks? Objects on Amazon smaller than they appear. Yeah, like every time. I don't know, this looks pretty big. No, that does look big. Well, the alpacas are just kind of watching. whole book. Air valves. And we need to pump this up of air? Apparently. All right, so this big one stinks. And the little turtle one wasn't great either. No, but old fashioned hose always works real well. Well, well and I, I think the round one. Yeah, the round one for sure. But uh, anyway, thank you guys for watching. See you next time.